our Prime Minister has come back from his third and greatest journey. And he said that the settlement of the Czechoslovakian problem, which has now been achieved, is, in my view, only the prelude to a larger settlement in which all Europe may find peace. This morning, I had another talk with the German Chancellor, Herr Hitler. And here is the paper which bears his name upon it as well as mine. Some of you perhaps have already heard what it contains, but I would just like to read it to you. We, the German Führer and Chancellor, and the British Prime Minister have had a further meeting today and are agreed in recognizing that the question of Anglo-German relations is of the first importance for the two countries and for Europe. We regard the agreement signed last night and the Anglo-German naval agreement as symbolic of the desire of our two peoples never to go to war with one another again. We are resolved that the method of consultation yeah, yeah. shall be the method adopted yeah, yeah. to deal with any other questions that may concern our two countries. And we are determined to continue our efforts to remove possible sources of difference and thus to contribute to assure the peace of Europe. There was no sign of British reserve as the crowds fought to get near the Premier's car. In a hundred days, you'll have your say. Whether Britain remains in a reformed Europe, enjoying all the benefits that brings, like lower prices in the shops, more jobs, and safer streets. Or whether those benefits are put at risk by leaving. We have a hundred days left to secure our future. It's a decision that will affect your future, your family's future, and the lives of everyone in our country. I believe if we stay in the EU, we'll continue to create further jobs and opportunities for young people over the country. As a former Royal Naval Reservist, I have seen firsthand how our country works with our European Union partners. And that's the kind of country that I want to leave for my children and grandchildren. I'm in because the European Union makes for a peaceful Europe. The EU, for lots of reasons, is beneficial for my family and I. If we came out of the EU, goodness knows what prices would be like. If free movement were to end following Brexit, is it not reasonable to suppose that we could see increases in wages for low-skilled workers in the UK? Well, if you're short of labour, the price for freight will go up. So, yes. I want to stay in because it'll allow our business to expand and create more jobs. I'm in because the EU secures the future for our young people. Britain is stronger, safer, and better off in Europe. If we leave the EU, we cannot, of course, leave Europe. Please join the campaign today and play your part in this crucial referendum. Don't get conned again. It's safer to take back control and spend our money on our priorities. Vote Leave, Take Control.